Right next, it's time to cross the pond again to join families on their trip of a lifetime to America. Yes, 23 sick or disabled children were chosen by Stoke-on-Trent-based charity Cordwell Children to enjoy a week in the sunshine at Disney World, Universal Studios and SeaWorld, along with their families. And our very own Annette Finch was invited along too. Today this could be the greatest day. Just five months ago, this little boy was critically ill in hospital. Samuel Griffith had a heart transplant after he was given just two years to live five years ago. He was meant to go on Cordwell Children's Disneyland Paris trip last year, but was too ill to travel, so he and his family missed out. It's amazing, everything since we've been here has been absolutely amazing. Um, they just, just seeing them smiling and just so full of life and everything all the time is just, just wonderful. Very, very emotional for us to see. The little boy from Newcastle under Lyme is on loads of medication, yet still continues to defy doctors and is doing really well since his surgery. Samuel's been in and out of hospital all of his life, so this was a well-deserved break for him and for his brother and sister, meeting characters they normally watch at home on TV. Samuel will need medical care for the rest of his life and might not be able to do everything that other little boys do, but not many little boys can say they've met Bart Simpson. And talking of Simpsons, here is another one. William Simpson is another little trooper. He has heart problems, which means he's already had two life-saving operations, even though he's only two. His family have been told he'll probably need a heart transplant in the future. So naturally, this trip means the world. They're so excited. Mommy, Everything we see, they want to Mommy, do. They're in they want to do everything, everything they see, can we do this, can we do that? And it's so good that we don't have to say no. Because William has thin blood, he takes daily medication to prevent bruising. So mum and dad have to keep a constant eye on him. To ensure his older brothers didn't miss out, Caldwell children helped out with childcare so everyone could have a good time, including mum here closest to the screen. Disney is all about dreams coming true, and the older kids loved meeting their favourite characters. But for little William, it was all a bit scary. Well, huge mice are quite frightening, aren't they? Money couldn't buy the happiness on the faces that we see when, and with the things like this. You'd probably never ever see the happiness again. Tomorrow we join Jake Feeney from Shirley as he goes abroad for the very first time and we find out more about the village which made these Midlands kids' wishes come true. Oh, fantastic stuff. And you can watch all of Annette's special reports from Florida again anytime on our website, itvlocal.com slash central.